I want to start with uh, saying that I understand that someone would make the, their slides in CMake because I use PowerPoint and try to insert code from Visual Studio inside. Anyway, before I begin, I need to comply with intellectual property rules uh, and laws, and uh, this bug is creation of my friend and colleague, and uh, he actually threatened me to return the favor with my own bug, but unfortunately for me, I think I have a hard time doing that in five minutes because I take, I put a lot of effort into my box. So, this is about uh, a network scanner in Avast. One of its job is to discover services on a network devices, and uh, if a port scanner discovers a service, you need to verify it somehow, because uh, it's not reliable. So, if we have a MQTT service on typical port, we need to talk to it before we flag it, as for sure. So, you write something like that, create a TCP connection, open it to the service, send some hello message, get a reply and verify it. Sounds, e sounds easy, right? All you need is the hello message. But if you look at the MQTT specification, it sounds a little less easy, quite complex, so I will introduce my own MQTTP. Uh, we have some boring headers, some magic letters of the protocol, payload size, and the actual payload we want to send. So, uh, luckily for us, the message can be encoded into a binary string. Being a laser programmer, I don't want to assemble it uh, in runtime. time. And if we look at the documentation, we can see we can do that. So, we write something like this. The MQTT string, and we send it. Actually, it doesn't work. So, you spend a lot of time checking your control flow, find nothing wrong, and uh, result into wrapped resort, which is Wireshark, and you find that you're sending some garbage. So, you encode it in URL, and this does work. Why do what? These two messages are supposed to be identical, aren't they? It turns out that they are not really identical. The first one is a little bit shorter. So, what's happening here? Have you ever performed a manual binary search comparing two strings to find, to trying to find the difference? Well, I have. It's not, <laughs> it's not fun. And uh, it turns out that uh, the first byte, the first section, X01M, is actually two byte long, plus trailing zero, Why the second string, magic string we have, is actually one byte. So, this string is actually one byte plus trailing zero. Nice catch, C++. How many of you knew that? I didn't. So, if you carefully read the documentation, you find a small paragraph saying, this. It's quite below the table, <laughs> so I don't think many people have read this. So to conclude this, I want to suggest that we all should be careful about our binary data in string letters, and uh, to fix this issue, we should uh, separate those uh, binary and non-binary parts of the string, and this is fine. Second thing I want to conclude from this is please use Intel assembly. This is a quote from Slack. <laughs> I quite agree. And the last thing, you know what this photograph is? It is a quite famous photograph of a German soldier in Berlin fleeing from east to west. <laughs> so, to take history lesson, if there is too much competition between East and West, things will go south, actually. <laughs> but... <laughs> but even if they do, the West eventually wins. <laughs> Thank you.